July 26th, 1967, a legend was born, a legend who will become an action icon. Born on July 26th, 1967, in Shirebrook, Derbyshire, England, Jason Statham grew up in a working class household. His father worked as a street seller and his mother was a dancer. Little did they know that their son would one day conquer the world of action cinema. Statham's early life was marked by a love for sports, particularly diving, which eventually led him to become a member of the British National Diving Squad. Far too much forward track. However, fate had other plans for Statham. While working as a model for clothing brands and participating in competitive diving, he caught the eye of a talent scout who saw something unique in his rugged charisma and athletic prowess. This serendipitous encounter would set the stage for Statham's transition from the high dives to high octane action on the big screen. Statham's breakthrough came in the late 1990s when he was introduced to filmmaker Guy Ritchie, who was in the process of casting his upcoming crime comedy, Lock, Stock and Two Smoking Barrels. Ritchie, known for his sharp eye for talent, recognized Statham's untapped potential and cast him as Bacon, a streetwise hustler with a penchant for trouble. I'm gonna kill him. Stop fucking about, Tom! And think about what we're gonna do now, sit down. This role marked the beginning of Statham's acting career and laid the foundation for what would become a prolific partnership with Ritchie. Lock, Stock and Two Smoking Barrels became a critical and commercial success, catapulting Statham into the spotlight. His portrayal of Bacon showcased a magnetic screen presence, blending wit with a physicality that hinted at the action star he was destined to become. Statham's performance not only endeared him to audiences, but also established him as a go-to actor for roles that demanded a combination of athleticism and charisma. Following the success of his debut, Statham continued his collaboration with Ritchie in Snatch, 2000, another crime comedy that further solidified his standing in the film industry. His roles in these early films showcased his versatility, but it was the 2002 action thriller, The Transporter, that truly propelled him into the realm of international stardom. The Transporter cast Statham as Frank Martin, a skilled and enigmatic driver for hire. The film's high-octane action sequences and Statham's magnetic on-screen presence resonated with audiences worldwide. Statham's portrayal of the stoic yet charismatic Frank Martin established him as a bona fide action star, a reputation he would go on to enhance in the years that followed. Statham's success in The Transporter opened the floodgates to a string of action-packed roles. His characters were often a blend of toughness, wit, and a code of honor, a formula that resonated with fans of the genre. Films like Crank, 2006, The Bank Job, 2008, and Death Race, 2008, showcased Statham's ability to deliver adrenaline-pumping performances while maintaining a magnetic screen presence. One of Statham's most iconic roles came with the Transporter series, where he reprised the character of Frank Martin in multiple installments. The franchise's success not only solidified Statham's status as a leading action star, but also turned him into a global sensation. Audiences were drawn to his no-nonsense approach, intense fight scenes, and a certain rugged charm that set him apart from his peers. Statham's career trajectory took another exciting turn with his involvement in ensemble casts, particularly in the Expendables series alongside action legends like Sylvester Stallone, Arnold Schwarzenegger, and Bruce Willis. Beyond the explosive action scenes, Statham has demonstrated a willingness to explore different facets of his craft. His role in the crime thriller The Italian Job, 2003, and the dark comedy Spy, 2015, showcased his comedic timing and versatility as an actor. These ventures into different genres proved that Statham was more than just a one-dimensional action star. He was a bona fide actor capable of adapting to diverse roles. Statham's journey to fame wasn't without its challenges. Critics initially pigeonholed him as a one-trick pony, dismissing him as a typecast action star. However, Statham's tenacity and commitment to his craft gradually eroded these preconceptions. His dedication to performing his own stunts, a rarity in an industry dominated by special effects, further endeared him to audiences 
and garnered respect from his peers. As the years passed, Statham's star continued to rise. His collaborations with acclaimed directors like Guy Ritchie, as seen in films like Revolver, 2005, and Wrath of Man, 2021, showcased a continued commitment to pushing boundaries and exploring new facets of his acting prowess. So, to Jason Statham, thank you for the thrills, the suspense, and the sheer entertainment you've brought into our lives. May your legacy continue to echo through the corridors of action cinema, inspiring generations to come. As the credits roll, let's celebrate the man, the myth, and the legend. Jason Statham. Until next time, stay entertained and always ready for the next adventure. Thanks for watching. Leave your opinion about this legend in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. It is little for you, but it means a lot to me. See you another time.